start by doing a fresh install of uh, Kodi and then downloading the uh, Indigo so that we can go ahead and get that splash screen. Alright, today we're going to be installing this on Windows. However, in the description of this video, I'm going to go ahead and leave the file path for all the different systems that you can go ahead and load Kodi on so that way you can go ahead and find these files. All right, so we finished installing Kodi. Let's go ahead and run it and uh, install Fusion and then download Indigo. So here we go. Now that we've installed Indigo, let's go ahead and press OK so that uh, Kodi can restart. All right, so to get rid of that splash screen, what we're going to go ahead and do is go into the files and just basically delete the picture. So on Windows, if you click on your file manager and uh, you click on this PC, you're going to click on your C drive. If you come up here to view, make sure that you have hidden items checked. Otherwise, you're not going to be able to get to the files. Click user. I'm agent 86. At data. Roaming. Cody. And here is our media folder. So, in the media folder, you have these two files. You have your skin default JPG and you have the splash PNG. So you can make another splash screen if you like. Maybe you don't want the Cody splash screen to come up. Maybe you want a picture of your family or, or a sunny beach or you know, whatever picture you like, whatever you prefer. So what you can do is you get that picture that you want, name it splash PNG. And that's what's going to pop up. So, for instance, maybe I like this picture here. All right, so notice here that the original splash screen is 1280 by 720, and it has a width of 1333 by 750. And we're going to want to come uh, as close to that as possible with our new image. So, I'm going to go ahead and open it with paint.net. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and resize it, and I'm going to save as, I'm just going to add a one here so we still have the original picture. So here goes the edited picture. And we're just going to go ahead and rename it Splash. So now if I delete this one and add this one, let's see what happens when we open Cody. And there we go. And if we just get rid of it all together, Then we have the default splash screen. So, round of brown. So, we definitely hope this video helped. Uh, thank you very much for subscribing, Rhonda. And uh, anyone else who's watching this video, make sure you go ahead and subscribe down below. I'm going to go ahead and leave a bunch of links down in the description of this video. If you have any uh, other questions for me, please go ahead and comment below. And uh, if you have any video requests of your own, 
go ahead and comment that below. And uh, hey, I'm not saying I'm going to get it in an hour, but sooner or later, I'll go ahead and get this video up for you guys. So with that said, thanks again for watching and uh, have a great day.